Uh, right now, with all the rain that we've been experiencing, is leading actually to a lot of flooding issues around the metro. One person was rescued from a car in Laurel. Not far from there, portions of a bridge on Route 198 was swept away. WSA 9's Mike Valerio picks up the story from there. Well, we just saw a section of the roadway leading up to the 198 bridge right here in Laurel collapse into the floodwaters that are just right over my shoulder here. And we actually had our time lapse photography going at the time that the roadway fell into the floodwaters here. And you can see there's a section of pavement that is just hanging over the Little Patuxent River right here. And it slowly, gradually begins to crack and then it falls into the river at the very last minute. This happened overnight floodwaters collecting here and we'll show you why exactly this is happening as we move a, a little closer to the edge of the bridge. You see all of this debris. This is causing a bottleneck and causing the floodwaters to channel not underneath the bridge but towards the edges and this is why the water is flowing from the edge 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 right here and then causing this section of the roadway to collapse just before this section of the concrete bridge begins. We can move over here and just show you this is the flood water uh, that continues to collect downstream. And this same thing happened last year where the flood water forced all of this debris into the middle of the, br of the bridge and then caused the opposite end to wash away and flood out. We just spoke with a uh, public information officer who's familiar with what it takes to fix this bridge, but he said at this point, until they clear that debris, they're not gonna be sure when uh, this will be completely repaired in terms of a dollar figure. He doesn't know that either. But what is for sure, this section of Route 198 and the middle of the Little Patuxent River closed for the foreseeable future. That's the latest from here in Laurel. Let's send it back to you. All right. Meantime, our